right, let's talk about what is going on with this trailer. We have replaced that window with plexiglass, replaced that window with plexiglass, replaced the door handle. I did have to back it with this piece of metal because the hole was so beat through. And I've pulled down cabinets. Let's go inside. All right, so back inside, it probably looks worse than it did before. I've started tearing things apart. Cabinet doors are off. Window coverings are off. Still no fridge. Started pulling things down in the bathroom. Took the mirror off. Cabinet doors off. Shower pieces. So today I want to pull all the doors out of here and go through and vacuum up all the dirt and debris. Just kind of clean it up a little bit and get down to the bones. And then I want to test the water system. Make sure there's no leaks between the water tank and the sink. And actually, I've just plugged in. So, all right, so check this out. That light is dead. This light works. This light works, but it has no on off switch. So that one needs to be replaced. Totally missing. Works. Works. Oh, you know what I just noticed? There's a bunch of ash in here. Holy cow. All right, let's vacuum this place out. All right, just opening this up, getting everything out, cleaning it out, makes it feel so much better. I found a bunch of cleaning products. Something to do with the gas valve. I have no clue. Cheetos. Some sort of tool. Some random bullets. Uh, like $3. Almost in change. The only place I found evidence of rodents was in this cabinet, which has access directly to outside. And this one, which is our water tank. This all needs to be thoroughly cleaned, so I'll probably get in here with some bleach. But right now, I want to see if this holds water and if the water pump works and all that jazz. So let's give it a go. All right, this is where the water goes into our trailer. This is quite broken. I'm going to have to figure out how to fix that. And hose goes in there. And we're going to turn it on. Okay, I can hear the water dripping in here. Ugh, mouse poop. Need to clean that. Not seeing any water coming out of the bottom of this container, so that's good news. Ah, bad news! I see water leaking. All right, let me go figure out where that's coming from. Okay, so that little bit was not connected, so it was leaking. I think there's about an inch of water in there, so it should be filling up the pump. Should we try it? I don't know. What do you guys think? What the heck? Let's give it a go. Dramatic moment here, and nothing. The water pump is dead. So, something we'll need to get is a new water pump. We'll replace that one in there. And after that, we can check the water heater. See if there's leaks anywhere else. All right, I think that's it for today, folks. All right, so let's discuss things we need. We need a new inlet for the water. I think our tank is okay. Seems to be holding. Uh, we definitely need a new water pump. Lots of new jalousie window bits. We need lots of the pieces for the windows. These are like almost all broken. A uh, couple new lights, probably both roof lights here. That one there. That one there because it has no off switch. I would love to find a stove and a fridge. Don't know whether the water heater works. Water heater is in here. 
looks like it's in good shape. It looks fairly new. There is a heater in here. I don't know if that works. We plan on tearing out the bathroom and turning that into a bunk bed area with some storage added on either end. And yeah, I've got, I've already purchased flooring. So we're gonna tear out this old linoleum. Oh, and check this out. Down in here, you can see the original linoleum. Eek. The cushions are old, but they seem to be in good shape. I may just try to recover them. Um, I think this is the way the bed bit goes in for the dinette. What do you guys think? Does that look right? I don't know why it's longer than the bed. I don't feel like that's right, but who knows? Yeah, uh, what other things am I going to do in here? Paint the cabinets. So I have dark, like royal blue for these bottom cabinets here. And this tall one will be all blue. And the bottom of the bunk bed area and the dinette. I think the dinette will stay wood. Maybe. We'll see. That top cabinet. This top cabinet. And whatever we figure out for the bed up here. This is supposed to be a really cool fold-up bed. That when you push it back up, it looks like a cabinet. And it clips into here to keep it from falling down. But there are none of the pieces left to it. And this piece of wood needs to be replaced. I do want to sturdy this up. This is only like a quarter inch plywood. I wouldn't really want to lay on that. So this will pull out into like a full size bed. All the way to the edge of here. And yeah, like overall still, I love this trailer. And I think that it has so much potential. So I know the updates on this are few and far between, but keep with it, keep with us guys, and, and you'll eventually see what we make of this. I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, make sure you do all the things like subscribe, share with your friends, and we'll catch you on the next one. And look, trailer's already paying me back. <laughs>